My name is Wayne Henson. I'm the site manager for Eastman Chemical in Pace, Florida. We make amines, which is reacting in ammonia with an alcohol, and those go into all kinds of different products. It goes into the fracking to stabilize the soil, agricultural applications and wastewater treatment applications, baby formula, sanitizing wipes, antiviral sprays, those applications that are really big right now. My name is Jamie Lowry. I work in the um, quality control and environmental lab. I do the sample shipping, which is um, small quantities of our products sent to um, customers that they want to do, or potential customers, and they use it to do some testing to see how it might work in their process. I always wanted to use my degree to go into manufacturing because we are making products here, products that help people and that, you know, that people actually buy and actually see. My name is Carlos McCall, I'm the operations team manager. I've been doing that position for about two years now. Manufacturing means to me the millions of things out there that we use on a daily basis. Somebody makes it all. My favorite part about being in the manufacturing industry is all the challenges. Just it's constantly evolving, it's constantly changing every day. You know, every day something kind of something comes up that you're gonna have to take care of. You might have to put together a team to find a solution, or you sometimes you might have to just uh, come up with a solution yourself, you know, and delegate it and, and get people to take care of things. So how our, our ordering process works is if a customer decides that they need a certain chemical, it will be verified that we have the capacity and we have the capability to make those requirements. We get the raw materials we need to make those chemicals in one of our runs and we'll, we'll make the final product, test its quality, and we'll ship that either through rail car, truck, or ice attainers to our customers. Manufacturing does offer a lot of growth and career opportunities, especially with a company like Eastman. We have manufacturing plants all across the globe. So being with a company like Eastman who really wants to strive to grow and to keep growing, there is a lot of that opportunity to, to grow and move forward. And because they have such diverse products, you know, you could go somewhere else and have a completely different experience and learn completely different things. To get into manufacturing, I think it's very important if you can do any internships or any co-ops or even just go in and visit some of these places and see what it is or even talk to people that do it and um, to see what it is they do to see if that's something that you would enjoy. In manufacturing, I was an apprentice. You start picking up on the, the basic skills that you're going to have to have in order to start working your ways through those levels. So uh, things I look for in an employee is going to be um, a good work ethic. You know, we all, we all have strong qualities. We've got to figure out what that is and use that to our advantage so we get out in front of everybody. You want to make yourself stand out. We have a very wide range of people that work here. We have operators that run the plant. We have maintenance mechanics. We have a group of electricians. We have laboratory technicians, engineers. We have health, safety, environmental, and security folks that maintain and help oversee the safety of the site. There's so many opportunities within the industry. My favorite part of working here is really the people. The people that I've worked with through the years, because I've, I've worked with a lot of different people in the time I've been here, and they taught me a lot. I've liked working in manufacturing because knowing that our products are going into products that people buy that actually helps their life. For this work, you have to have a certain amount of confidence because you have people counting on you to make decisions based on uh, your training and your judgment. I see manufacturing going and just becoming more high tech. I think you'll always need the people, but they're just going to get more advanced equipment to work with, better software to use, you know, safer places to work. It'll keep evolving like it always has.